Welcome back to Ozarks Fox AM. Now Kaylee's making us something delicious for Cinco de Mayo. What you making? Making some horchata. Horchata. So uh, never had this before. I don't mm -hmm. think you guys have either. Mm -hmm. So uh, I taste tested it, and it's really good, honestly. Oh, good. Oh, good. good. And this is a milk-based drink. I'm not even a fan of, honestly, like hot chocolate or, um, I don't know. I don't drink a lot of milk. Mm -hmm. But uh, this is this is one for the books. I like to hear that because I don't think Jeremy's a milk drinker mm -mm. and I'm not either. Nope. Don't so. like me milk. Never have. <laughs> Let's Never get started. Either. That's so wild. All right. So you do one and this is a keto non-alcoholic version. Oh, so nice. um, about two grams per serving and you can get about two cups of these cups. OK, well, I, I got to admit she's using silk, which actually is makes here. a difference. Yeah, right. So that's almond milk, is it? Uh, the recipe it? called for almond milk, but I don't know. Maybe I just had so many years of almond milk that I'm sick of it. So well, I what is soy silk? milk? Silk, it's non-dairy. Okay. So, I mean, you can use whatever milk, I'm sure. I bought it before matter. for my cereal. I just yeah. can't remember what it's made of. That's what I was wondering. Yeah, this one's made of soy. Oh, soy, okay. that's it. Kaylee, so, so let me ask you, is this naturally an alcoholic drink then? Yeah. Oh, okay. See, now, Kaylee, I want to say, rum. as you're making it, I could have sworn I had a hot version of this when I was in Mexico on working on the cruise ship. We'd oh. go to this little late night bar and it would show old black and white movies. And you had this and it was like, a, it was a hot drink. But again, it could be something totally different and I'm just getting the color mixed up. Or maybe they do it both ways. Like coffee, hot yeah. and cold. I don't know. All right, so we've got one cup of milk, two tablespoons of any sweetener of your choice. And then uh, two tablespoons of your heavy whipping cream, Woo. which I do overflowing. <laughs> nice. So you're heaping those. It'll just make it creamier. Yeah. Yes. All right. And then you've got. Mm, it called for about an eighth of cinnamon, but that's about a few shakes. Okay. And then. No, it called for a half a teaspoon and of cinnamon, and then one eighth teaspoon of vanilla. Oh, okay. okay. I like oh, how you're yeah. not measuring. Yep. You're a pro. Yep. That's how we do it on TV. That's how that's how the pros do it. <laughs> we are laughing. What did you just add? Salt? Pinch salt, of salt. Yes. And then you shake it up. Yes. See, sweet and salty. That's right. I add that to my, my drinks when I make them, like coffee drinks or whatever. You can add the ice before you shake it too, but. I can't wait to try it. I know. I'm wondering, you know, I sometimes associate cinnamon with Christmas. Oh, yeah. You know, I'm just because you have all the cinnamon treats and the smells. I associate and... it with oatmeal. I had some this morning. <laughs> <laughs> I woke up so hungry, and look at us. We're eating all day. Can I tell you, y'all, if you're watching at home, we're still in the first hour of the show. Uh, we've... we got a whole other hour of cooking left That's to go. Right. <laughs> okay. 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 I'll let you. Okay. Which one is for it? Who? Okay. This I'm going to grab this one. Okay. Thank you. I'm going to give it. It smells like a snickerdoodle. Mm. Ooh. And that's nice. That is real. That is delicious. That is I was nice. surprised. Mm -hmm. And then you, to make it alcoholic, you just add white rum. Oh, um. rum is what goes in it if you drink it with alcohol. Okay. Mmm. Pretty good. It is. I'm surprised, yeah. This would be good milk to add I to cereal. I think that's delicious. <gasps> you could. What could it, you do? She just said you could add this milk to cereal. You could. But you know what it tastes like, though, Kelly? <laughs> but it already tastes, it tastes so like the milk that's left over after you eat Cinnamon Toast but Crunch. I, I yeah. don't, but yeah. I don't like that. Because. Why? Because it's warm. <laughs> it's usually warm, and it's. I, I have a weird deal with milk. I'm sorry. You, you have you it like warm milk cold. in your cereal? No. Once you put the milk in the cereal, once the cereal's gone, then what's left over, I don't want that. Just don't. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> But to listen, their own. Kaylee, what about this in a blender too? Like blending the ice all up, wouldn't that be good too? Smoothie. Uh huh. Yeah. Right, just smoothie. Oh my gosh, Kaylee. That's you... very delicious, Kaylee. Okay, what I've loved now is we have, ladies, we have a drink for the second hour. Yeah. We have some make more too. appetizer, some guacamole and pico de gallo, and then coming up the second hour, we're making chimichangas in our community cuisine. We posted a picture. Go comment it, and we'll read them live on the air. Don't go anywhere. More fun Cheers, on the Cinco de Mayo after this. Mm -hmm. Cheers! Mm -hmm. I brought margaritas as a backup, but you I didn't even need them. Chug that. Yeah, yeah, it's good.